Now, Sweb, you've been mentoring many current and future leaders. Can you maybe share a success story or two where you mentored somebody and that person took your advice to heart? Yeah, I think, you know, it'd be difficult to sort of share names at this stage. Uh, but I think uh, two stories come to mind. Uh, the one was almost by accident. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I didn't believe this. Mm -hmm. And uh, I've been talking to my daughter on and off for many, many years mm -hmm. about things. And she continues to surprise me with what she has remembered and recalled. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the other day she was telling me, when she was nine years old, I was teaching her about savings. And I thought, man, I must have been a really bad dad, you know, to, to put a nine-year-old through mm -hmm. this. But the fact that she recalled that, and, you know, I see in how she's grown up as a young as a young lady today, mm -hmm. uh, I think you know that's that's the one example you know, that I look back and I think, you know, uh, I was sharing these things, mm -hmm. these anecdotes. Uh, she used to call them our talks, mm -hmm. uh, and they seem to you know she's taken some of that to heart, and it's it's wonderful to see her blossom mm -hmm. into a young uh, young lady today. Uh, in the business world, you know, uh, I've had a, a couple of people where, and it's been really interesting. You impact people at kind of where they are at that moment in time. Mm. And sometimes it has been a leadership type of impact. Sometimes it has been a career impact. Others, it's just been the ability to listen to their problems and, mm. you know, it's, it's, that's got nothing to do with work. Mm. And uh, it's always rewarding to see people uh, engage on those topics mm. and then find their own way forward. I think it's less about what I sometimes say. It's the ability to think together with someone and offer mm. an ear. And most people have the solutions in their own, mm. in the, within themselves. And you've just got to have the opportunity to sit, listen, engage, mm. think together, and those surface. Now, Sweb, so can you maybe share with us who are the role models of leadership or the books about leadership that you would recommend future leaders should study? <laughs> uh, there's, 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 there's so many over the years that one reads, you know. Uh, I, I think I... I truly embraced it, the principle or this idea of doing good whilst doing good business. And mm. I think the first time I came across it was in a Richard Branson book, mm. probably some 15 years ago. And it really appealed to me. And when I think of where the world is today, mm. you know, you cannot dissociate the two. Mm. This idea of doing good whilst doing good business. Uh, you know, and I don't see it as charity. I don't see it as CSI. I see it as an inherent part of getting business done. Uh, and so there's a responsibility on leaders to, to, to do that. And then I was most surprised in his recent book that I read to find out that this principle of doing good whilst doing good business actually originated from a conversation that Richard Branson had with Madiba. Okay. So it was really cool to find that this, this, this idea that I'd so embraced actually is an African idea. And that was really cool. I believe Madiba was part of the Microsoft journey opening a number of centers. I saw at the entrance. Oh, yes. Uh, yeah, my journey with Microsoft started some seven years ago. Okay. And uh, yes, that is correct. Now, um, Sweb, how can people get hold of you and where can they follow you? Um, I think, you know, the best place is probably uh, LinkedIn and Twitter. Right. And they can find me at, at Zoeabh, Z O A I B H. Right. And last but not least, is there one piece of advice? that you would like to give to future leaders, that they should implement in their daily leadership? Yeah, build trust, mm. be authentic, be inquisitive, be mm. curious, and have fun. Okay. Well, Sweb, thank you so much for sharing your insights into the future and uh, help, helping us to build the future. And uh, speaking to you, there is... Uh, I don't just see insights, I see wisdom. So uh, thank you very much for sharing your wisdom and your inspiration. Thank you, far too kind, but thank you. I really enjoyed our conversation. Thank you.